loves is trying the Kung Po chicken. And she says it's not spicy when I say that it is. Not it's spicy. spicy. No. Nah. It is. It is not spicy. Get over it, it's spicy. Not really. No. Well, we're going to argue about this all day, aren't we? guys so today we are here at Bang Bang Oriental Food Hall it is the largest and the newest Asian food hall here in London so Bang Bang Oriental is located at Edgeware Road and they're open from Monday to Sunday from 12 to 9 you can park here at Morrison's car park it says they have three hours free parking for Bang Bang Oriental customers so as you enter the Bang Bang uh, food hall, there will be a guy waiting there and he'll ask you to download the QR scanner onto your phone if you don't already have it. Then what you do is, is you scan the barcode on the little sign and then that goes into the NHS track and trace service for the coronavirus. So it all helps to keep us safe. Hi guys, so we just arrived at the Bang Bang food hall. And we're just having a little look around to see what we can choose for our lunch. Uh, there's loads of different places to choose from, all different uh, Asian and Chinese cuisines. So you've got Chinese, you've got Japanese, you've got Malaysian, you've got all different types of Asian. And oh, it's amazing, really, to be honest. The amount of choices and options here. Wow, I don't even know how long it's going to take us to choose. Probably going to take about half an hour just to choose what we want. <laughs> wow. So I've decided to go for the Kung Po chicken, which I bought from Hakka, which is a homemade southern Chinese food. It does have a little bit of spice, but I've asked for milder spice. So what I'm eating right now is rice with side salad and a Kung Po chicken. Well, this Kung Po chicken is I asked for a little bit of spice, but ooh, it's got quite a lot. <laughs> but it's cooked really well. Really crispy chicken. Very good marinade. And look, you can see the chilies in there. Maybe I need to avoid those. <laughs> Take them out. But it's really nice. And you get all of this massive plate for only £9.50, which is that's a pretty good price considering we're in London as well. Pretty good. Oh, that's so spicy. Loads of water. Oh I mean, some parts of it are not so spicy, and then you try other bits, it's like. Oh, dear. is trying the Kung Po chicken and she says it's not spicy when I say that it is. Not it is spicy. spicy. No. Nah. It is. It is not spicy. Get over it, it's spicy. Not really. No. Well, we're going to argue about this all day, aren't we? It's spicy. Kung Po chicken is not spicy. It is. It's <laughs> not. Obviously got a different tongue to me. Asian tongue, English tongue, taste buds. It's not spicy. What I have here is a nasi goreng, a Malaysian fried rice with uh, fried egg, beef, chicken. some string beans as well there is chili as well oh let me try this chili mm. that chili is not spicy that is cool i've just tried one and it's blown me head off yeah there is prawns as well so it's a chicken and prawns uh, malaysian fried rice so when you order some food from the particular food outlet that you've chosen, 
you get given a little device and you just keep it on your table and then when it starts to beep you go and collect your food from where you bought it from. Quite a good idea, very good. Oh wow, she's brought this back. I don't even know what it is, but I'm sure we're gonna find out now. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, is this your second meal? Yeah. Oh wow, she just had a whole special fried rice and whatever, and now we've got one of these. This is a prawn chong fu. This is so wow, look at that. Wow. Oh wow. So Nevs is trying her dish which it's I don't a, have a clue what the name is, but and I keep trying to say it but I can't say it. <laughs> it's a prawn chong fu. Prawn chong fu? Prawn song food. <laughs> Funny. So let her give that a try. That's more her sort of thing. Mm. Oh. Wow. That was rougher. I don't know what it's made of. But it's really nice. It's not in your mouth. Wow. This wrapper, when it's inside your mouth, just melt. Nev's favorite words, melt in the mouth. Yeah, melt in your mouth. <laughs> mm. Oh, this is the last one. Oh. Soft, look how soft that is. Soft. Wow, just like the real buns. Yeah, it's really what The bread is really white, to be honest. Some, some buns, they, they have like, yeah. Um, what is it like yellow with something color? That is pork. Let's try the sauce. So this is a this is a pork bun. The sauce. Let's try the sauce. Hmm, nice. Bit sweet. Wow. Another three buns. They're all the same. Yeah. Oh. Wow. 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 So I'm just walking around and there's lots of people here, lots of Asian. All oh, everyone looking around, it's very busy. But it's also once you sit down at the tables, all the tables seem to be about two meters apart. There's a huge TV screen in the middle of the thing so you can kind of watch TV if you want and chill out. But it's really, really relaxed and they've got, a, whatever it is, blow it. They've got a good air con in here, it's lovely. So I'm ordering their, I'm gonna try this jasmine green milk tea. Jasmine green milk tea. So let's try this jasmine green milk tea from Tiger Hill. Mm. Yeah, it's a combination of the, the milk and the tea. The tea is really strong and the boba is yeah, it's good. It's really good. Yeah. Try it at Tiger Hill. So I I choose boba pearls because uh, oh I love boba. Three pound seventy for the uh, regular size. Mm hmm.